All right, so we start by opening the Amazon Alexa app. Then we go over to the more in the bottom right and go to skills. Then once skills is done loading, we're going to go ahead and type in the search bar e-home life. Then the app is going to pop up here on the screen with the little blue circle with the house. Click on that and click enable to use. So once you've completed the login of the skill, it's then going to prompt you to close it here on the screen and then it is going to ask you to search for devices. Go ahead and click uh, discover devices and then it is going to take you back to the primary Alexa screen and search for a new device. Now once it's on this screen, it's going to take about 45 seconds to uh, search for the device. Uh, mine failed a couple times because I already had a device named Garage Door on my Amazon account. So just be aware if you have something that has the same name, you're going to need to have to change the name or delete it during the setup process. Uh, but once you have it all logged in and synced, then you can go back and name everything whatever you want. I sped up the timeline here to make it easier for everyone to watch, so I'm just going to cut to the end here real quick. Alright, so now that we've found the device in our Alexa app, there's the option to open by voice. So this command is going to require a four-digit PIN number, so you can't have a random individual get a hold of it and try to open your garage, whether it's with Alexa or any other smart home device. So you're going to have to put in a four-digit code and then after you've put in the four-digit code and it's been accepted, that little uh, bubble switch will be moved to the right and then you'll have enabled uh, one, the garage door functionality from Alexa as well as the ability to give her voice commands to open, close, and check the status of your garage door. Now here's what it looks like fully enabled after you've entered your four digit PIN. And then I back out here to go over how you get to the device from the home screen of the app. Start on the home screen, hit devices on the bottom. In the top you scroll all the way over to all devices. And then you scroll down to whatever you named the device in your uh, Amazon Alexa app. I named mine the garage door. The reason is when you give a command and it has the word the in there, it is much smoother when you're saying open the garage door. Thank you everyone for watching the video. Please like and subscribe to the channel and I will have the link to the Refos Smart Wi-Fi Garage Door Opener in the description below as well as the link to the first video about how to install and set up the smart Wi-Fi garage door opener. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.